Hi Taurus, Heather here from the Crystal Vein Tarot here to do your weekly reading for April 27th through to May 3rd. So this reading is for the Sun Moon Rising sign of Taurus and it is a general reading and therefore will not resonate for, with everyone so be sure to check out your Moon and Rising sign readings as well. So I am using the Legacy of the Divine Tarot. I've pulled one card for the week plus a clarifier and I'm going to be reading the bottom of the deck for the overall energy for the week and I've pulled an animal speak room. So Taurus, let's see what we have for you. Okay, so we have the wheel and it is being clarified by the Eight of Cups. And at the bottom of the deck, okay, so we have the Ace of Swords at the bottom of the deck. There we go. Which is nice to see because aces are always new beginnings or new opportunities. And our animal speak rune we have, trying to make sure the glare is not on it, the horse. And the horse is about movement. Okay, so Taurus, so your overall energy for the week is that of the Ace of Swords. And aces are always new opportunities, new beginnings, new starts, new things coming in because they represent one, and that's the beginning of something. Being swords energy, that is air energy or intellectual energy, all of your thoughts, beliefs, ideas, anything that's going on in the head, it's that mental energy. So this can play out in terms of like a, a new idea, a mental clarity, the sword of truth, so some, something could be happening this week for you, Taurus. So this week could be filled with new ideas. You're finding that kind of mental inspiration or mental clarity this week. Now you have the wheel as the card this week. And the wheel, this is the wheel of fortune. And this represents good fortune, a turning point. Um, can also represent good luck. But this is the universe kind of having your back and you being blessed with good luck. So if you've been experiencing um, some negative situations in your life, negative things going on in your life, um, or just feel, feeling like nothing has been playing out in your favor, um, this is indicating that, that the energy is changing. So that wheel is turning. So as you were on the way down, you're now going to be coming up. So you're getting that good luck. It's that turning point or that good fortune coming in. However, if you've been riding a high and things have been going really well, this can also tell you, like let you know, this is the whole cyclical energy of um, there's always ups and downs in life. So for some of you um, that things have been going very smooth, you could be experiencing a few bumps this week. So it can also represent that as well. It is being clarified by the Eight of Cups. Cups is water energy or emotional energy, things that emotionally fulfill us. But you see how this guy, um, he's got his back turned to these eight cups. And these are things that used to fulfill him emotionally, things that used to please him, things he used to enjoy. And he's turned his back away from, it, from them. He's walking away from them. But he's walking away from them because they don't emotionally fulfill him anymore. So this is a withdrawal retreat or moving on from something. So with these new ideas coming in, with this mental clarity and this, this turning point of luck, so this turning point of luck could be triggered by you getting um, this week having mental clarity, um, seeing some mental clarity or even having new ideas. Um, you're very mentally active this week and it's making you leave something behind that's no longer serving you or no longer working for you. And this could, so if, the, if things haven't been working in your favor, it's be, it could be because you know, you've been working on something that just doesn't fulfill you anymore. It's just not, not really kind of your path anymore. So now you're finally like moving away from it and choosing to move away from it. And as you do that, your, your luck is turning or things are turning around for you. Because then you also have the movement here, the horse. And the horse, again, it represents move, movement. But it indicates that, that there's going to be movement and progress now in your life. And that the movement is um, best accomplished through self-discipline, so physical and mental discipline. Um, so the horse does remind you that you need that there's a need in your life for self-discipline in your endeavors, and it helps. Um, and that to remind you that self-discipline helps your growth to be controlled and steady, rather than spikes and ups, having those ups and downs, but rather that that progression of um, of movement and that continuous flow up and forward. 
So it's, it's reminding you, the horse reminds you to continue forward in your efforts and um, that if you're disciplined in your movements that your sense of power will also be renewed. And horse also brings balance into your life as well. But it does indicate that um, things are moving forward, um, that things are going kind of full steam ahead for you in your life or something, an area in your life, something you've been wanting to do or are doing, it's, it's going full, moving forward full steam ahead. So Taurus, this concludes your reading for the week of April 27th through to May 3rd. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Be sure to subscribe and click on that notification bell so you are notified when the next readings are available. And again, thank you for joining me and um, have a fabulous week, Taurus, and take care.